Hey guys, I'm Reed Alexander, Neville from Nickelodeon's iCarly, and as an actor, I spend a lot of time on set, so when I come home, I love hanging out in my kitchen. Cooking is so much fun to do with your friends or for your family, and today I'm going to show you one of my favorite recipes ever. It's a cool whole wheat veggie pizza, and I've got everything ready to go here so we can get cooking. I've got a 100% whole wheat crust. This is some spinach, and I've got all my vegetables here. These are some pre-chopped mushrooms. I buy them pre-chopped. They save me a lot of time. This is 2% low-fat mozzarella cheese, pre-shredded. And then I've got some bell peppers here. I love bell peppers. They taste awesome. I think they're really cool because when you put them on the pizza, they have a lot of color. So notice with this pepper, I cut the top off, I cut the bottom off. Now I'm gonna stand it up and you can just sort of come in here, pull out all these seeds, because we don't want to eat that. And then you cut down, push this to the side, come in here, get rid of this waxy part in the pepper. You don't want that either. And now we've got this nice clean bell pepper here and you can just cut straight down. I started Cool Bites because in March 2009, you know, I was really, I was overweight, I was out of shape, and my energy level was very, very low. So I really wanted to make a lifestyle change. I wanted to feel better about myself. Okay, got all my vegetables here. I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil in each pan. There was nothing out there for a kid, from a kid. I wanted to help solve that problem. So that's what Cool Bites is. That's where it came from. I've got these set over probably like medium to high heat, very, very easy. And now, go ahead and put these in. Got my peppers that I'm gonna saute. I'm gonna saute some mushrooms here. I'm gonna do the same with some spinach. Okay, phenomenal. So we've got our olive oil in the pan. We always want to season everything we're cooking. We want to give it a lot of flavor. Got some garlic powder here. You know, garlic is really healthy for you, plus it tastes awesome. I really like it. So we're going to follow that up with a little bit of black pepper, just to, you know, give it really nice flavor. All about the flavor when you're cooking. That's what makes it really fun. And you know what else I love? This pizza has no rules. I mean, do it however you want. If you don't want pepper, don't use pepper. If you want to make it spicier, go for it. And then you just want to mix it all around. So now we've set it over the medium heat and a little oil, and these will be done cooking for us soon. Okay, so this is where cooking really gets fun. We've got a lot going on. There's a lot of action. We're sauteing those veggies on the stove. We've got our crust in the oven crisping up. We don't want to forget about it. We want to keep an eye on it so it doesn't burn. So we've got our oven glove, and we're going to go right in here, 375, about three to five minutes. This is what we want to see. Notice the crust is sort of brown. It looks really good. And you know, the vegetables are smelling great. And everything's done sauteing. So we're gonna get some tongs and we're gonna layer this. We've got our spinach that we cooked. I always like to put the spinach on top. That's like the first layer, right on top of the crust. And you can just spread it out evenly. You know, just so you've got like a nice even coat. Done, okay, now for the mushrooms. That's what I like to put second, the second layer. This kitchen is smelling so awesome, I cannot wait to eat this pizza. And then we've got the peppers on top. And remember, we thought they were gonna look really cool. Well, they do. I mean, they're very colorful and it all looks delicious. But now we're on to the last phase of our cooking. Remember that 2% mozzarella cheese? We wanna put that on top just to top it off. Probably want a handful. I don't know, like maybe half a cup. And then just cover it evenly on top. Okay, great. Got our oven glove waiting for us right over here. And we're gonna put this back in the oven for probably about two to three minutes, still on that 375. And this will be all done. You know, I've been really thrilled because the results that I've had, I lost 15 pounds. It took me a few months and definitely some work and taking all those notes and learning a lot about myself, finding great tips. But you know, I've just been really excited because I feel like the results are ongoing too. And I always say I'm a work in progress. I'm never finished. And every day when I wake up in the morning, it's another chance for me to do my best when it comes to my health. So it's been about two to three minutes in the oven, 375 degrees, and the cheese is melted. It's gotten a little brown. It's perfect. It's exactly how we want it. And I mean, who doesn't love hot pizza? It's totally fresh. Great, so now we can cut into it and try it. Look how good that looks. And that was so easy. And you know, this will probably make, I don't know, maybe six large slices or even eight medium, depending on how big you want to make them. Let's take a bite and see how it is. Mmm. That's amazing. And you know what? It was so much fun to make. So I really hope you guys try it. And I'm Reed Alexander for CoolBites.com. And don't forget to check out the awesome FanLaLa.com. It's amazing. And thank you so much for tuning in. Bye.